If you look down, you probably notice that you've got dressings on. So in this video, we'll be talking about your dressings. I use different dressings depending upon what situation I'm going to be using. So if you've had a breast augmentation, the most common dressing that I will use will be a dressing called Comfeel. It's a transparent bit of tape that where you can actually have a look through the dressing directly to your wound edges. Um, and it's made of a gel. So it's normal for it to suck a bit of fluid into it. And when you see that, when you look down with the mirror or um, or if someone looks for you, sometimes it looks like a little bit of a, a pale collection of fluid underneath the dressing. It's not pus, it's the gel that's sucking the fluid in and it's completely normal. The dressing is waterproof so you can have a shower even day one after your surgery, but just try and make sure that it's short and sweet, not too hot and avoid baths until we let you, let you know that you can have a bath. We've covered this in the, the bathing section anyway. Um, if you've had a breast reduction, sometimes I need to use bigger or more extensive dressing so you might have incisions around the nipple straight down and towards the crease so if you've had a more extensive procedure like that with the a glue tape dressing that stays on for two weeks and completely waterproof again but the same rules apply when it comes to showering just so short and sweet and uh, not too hot and um, and no bars until we let you know. Now the dressings all get changed um, at a variable time after surgery. So if it's one of those Comfeel dressings, it's usually changed at around about a week to 10 days. If it's a Prineo or glue tape dressing, it's usually around about two weeks. But if you are concerned at any time, don't hesitate to reach out to our nurse and we can see you any day of the week, uh, Monday through Friday anyway, if there are any concerns about your dressings that you might need them changed. So any concerns, feel free to take a photo and send it through to us. We're only too happy to help you with things. The dressings themselves are usually covering subcutaneous sutures that, that dissolve on their own. So you don't need to worry about having the stitches taken out either. Um, so if you've got any questions about the dressings, don't hesitate to reach out. Did you like that video? Well, if you did like it and you want to find out more, don't hesitate to reach out to dralexpoon.com.